What's up guys, it's your boy DS and today we are going to be getting the Frost set. Now this is going to be the third out of the three different sets that I've uh, made videos on. There is obviously the Flame set, then there is the Lightning set, and now there is the Frost set. All three of these sets have the same exact uh, passive bonus for their respective places or elements. So, uh, and they all look really nice. They all basically mirror the dragons. So this is just, these are just all really cool sets to have. But anyways, I want to go ahead and, you know, get the frost set for you guys because I know a lot of you guys actually like this outfit too. So it's pretty nice. Uh, the first place we're going to be going is going to be right here on the map. Uh, there's going to be a cave there. So you guys can jump from the tower and just make your way there. But here we go. As you guys see, the cave is going to be right here on your map. If you guys want to, you know, take a look around where it is, you're going to be going into here. So now that you're here, you go ahead and make your way inside. And there's going to be some enemies and stuff in here, but you don't got to worry about that. You literally can just run past everything. Just keep running and then you'll get right here set this on fire you'll wait a second and then once this is uh burnt out it will literally be right here and now you have your first piece all right so the next place we're going to be going is going to be over here and you can teleport back to the, the tower so you guys can jump and make your way there. And as you guys see, once you come here, it'll be at the very bottom. You can go ahead and run past that. And what you want to do is you'll come fly here and you'll just look right. Right? And you want to use a bomb to open that area right there to your right. And it's going to be right inside here. And now you have your second piece. Now we once again teleported back to the tower. And the last place we're going to be wanting to go is going to be right around here. As you guys see there. So go ahead and shoot out the tower and make your way there. And whenever you get over here, you don't want to fly down there. You actually want to make sure you come here to this river. I think it's a river. But anyway, now that we're here... You'll glide down, and you'll be able to go inside. Now, for this, what you want to do is... You actually want to get on top of these, like, ice things right here. And then two frost bats are going to be coming towards you. You want to shoot those. And the reason why is because they're going to make these little frost blocks right here. Now, you want to take one of them and move it over there. And then after that, you can move it back to you, jump on it, and then you want to rewind. And what this will allow you to do is it'll basically bring you to this wall that you can jump on. And then you want to basically jump onto the next wall right here. And the reason why is because if you, if you jump onto the ice... You'll slide down, but if you jump onto the normal wall, you'll be good to go. And then the third and final piece is going to be right here. Now, as you guys see, here is the frost set. Uh, like I said, it actually looks really nice. Uh, the headpiece is all right, but uh, as far as the shirt and then like the pants go and the shoes and everything, I know a lot of people are, are going to like how like elegant, I guess it looks. But um, as you see, it's not, you know, it's not lit up right now. And that's because we're not in like a frozen area. So we're going to go ahead and go to a frozen area so you guys can see how it actually looks there. So now that we're in a freezing area, you guys can see that we are glowing now. Although we are cold because obviously uh, we don't have cold resist because we have cold weather attack. But it is lighting up now. And uh, so at the end of your combo or your charged attacks, you will do an ice attack. As you guys see right there, which will basically allow you to do ice damage to your enemies and then freeze them as well. And then uh, the cool thing about it, obviously, is if you guys, you know, are cold, 
you can add it to you know a, a piece of you know cold resist and you guys will be good to go you guys won't be freezing anymore and then uh obviously if you need a little more cold resist you can add extra you know cold resist to it and still be able to get off the you know ice attack as you guys see right there it'll just it's not going to be as strong but it is still going to be able to be used so uh you'll just have to mix and match as far as you know if you're cold or not or how cold you are or whatever the case may be and maybe you don't care maybe you just want to rock the entire outfit maybe you're just fighting enemies or a boss really quick then you know if that's the case you can obviously just put the whole thing on and do whatever you need to do and uh get off that damage and then after that go on about your way but there you guys go. That's going to be it for this video. Be sure to give it a like, subscribe to the channel if you're new. Comment down below. Tell me what you guys think in the comments below. With that being said, I'll see you guys next time. Peace.